On this episode of the show, we are going to talk about the two different paths that very, very, very successful families took to get to very different places. Creating wealth, protecting families, building legacy. This is the Rich Life Lawyer Show. Hey, everybody, this is Christopher Small, and this is episode 62 of the Rich Life Lawyer Show. I am your host. I'm the owner of CMS Law Firm, an estate, estate planning firm, and I'm, I'm excited to be here with you again for another fun episode. Today, we're going to talk about two families the Vanderbilts and the Rockefellers. These two families were, were at one point in time the richest families, the richest people probably uh, on earth. Uh, definitely the richest uh, people or the richest families in the United States. One family, the Rockefellers, after six generations of this kind of wealth have continued to have their wealth um, grow and their family grow. Um, the Vanderbilts, on the other hand, sort of lost everything. And there, there's a reason that they did that and it's around the way that they structured their trusts and they structured their estate planning. Uh, one family, the Vanderbilts, structured it so that checks were just written, money was wasted. There were uh, 10 mansions built in New York City at one time and uh, there were you know, lavish parties and there's all kinds of this stuff. And as you might expect, in two, three generations, all that money was gone. It's like a hundred billion dollars gone okay so it's a very very significant amount of money and today they're there Anderson Cooper is a Vanderbilt heir you know from CNN and he's he has nothing he has nothing from them you know he's earned everything he's gotten the other the other family the Rockefellers they're the complete opposite they set their family trusts up and their estate plan up so that their their heirs their kids and their grandkids and their great-grandkids had um, endless opportunity they had endless um, they had the ability to get uh, to take money out of the equation, so that meant that they could pursue their passions, they could pursue what they wanted to in life, but they also had to be successful, contributing members of the family. Um, that, along with a, a sneaky little life insurance uh, sort of financial setup, allows them to create and use their trusts like a bank, where the family fortune continues to grow as the family um, success continues to grow. So. The reason I wanted to tell you about this is because you know we all have a choice between what kind of family that we want to be. We can be uh, the Vanderbilts, right? We can flame out, or we can be the Rockefellers, and, and we can set it up so that each generation continues to grow and become stronger and become more successful. I would love to talk to you more about that and help you with that if you want. Um, if you're interested, you can call me, 206-659-1512. You can email me, chris at cmslawfirm.com. I'll be talking more and more about this in future episodes, but think about it you know just uh, imagine a time and understand that uh, you can have a fantastic family that lasts uh, multiple multiple generations uh, of wealth creation all right thank you for your time I will talk to you soon